I never hang out with people if they can't give me shit. Now, that might sound really fucked up. And yeah, it is fucked up. Like, I'll admit it, I'm, I am an asshole. But I'm pretty nice too. But one of the instincts I had when I was young is I would never hang out with anyone if they can't give me shit. Now, I, if I hang out with someone, I will give them extreme amounts of value. I'll hang out with someone and then he will suddenly fucking get jacked or he will suddenly make a lot, a lot of money. I'm telling you, if you're that guy, you can do that for your people as well. If you're that guy, you can literally, everyone around you, you can uplift them just because of your actions, your word, your example, and the way you are with people. You're not this other friend, and you know, I am an asshole. I told him like, hey bro, you're fat as fuck. I kept telling him that. I kept bullying him. Fat as fuck, fucking loser, chicks don't like you, blah, blah, blah. And then this month, he's like, hey bro, I lost like, what did you lose, like 20 pounds? I mean, that guy was fat, but he was, he's a smart person, so I like hanging out with him. He's a very smart person. You know, back to my rule, I only hang out with people if they can give me shit. But you should do the same. The reason you guys just are at a, such a low level, and believe me when I say this, you guys are actually at a low level. And let me tell you why. Even me personally, I don't think I am where I should be at or where I can be at. I haven't reached my potential. But even me, I have a bachelor's degree in two degrees. I got a free ride scholarship to the USA. I was Austrian champion in the sprints. I qualified for the European championship. I speak four languages. I'm good with chicks. I'm charismatic. I'm built as fuck. Like my earnings are like the top 1% of my age. And even, I believe it's probably top 1% of like everyone in the world at my income level. But the point is even I look in the mirror. Even me. And I'm like, I gotta get better. I gotta get even fucking crazier. And then I see people like you. I'll be on the streets. Look, I'll be in the streets. Walk. I use yourself. And then I'll just be looking at people, you know? And then I was like with a friend of mine. He's a friend of mine. And we were walking. And he saw me just look at people. He's like, friends, why do you look at everyone like with, with like disdain? Like, what do you mean, bro? In your eyes, I can see like the disdain. It's like you just, just think everyone's like just ants. Like just fucking in your way. I'm like, yeah, he's right. I despise people. It's just so, such a low level. Zero performance. Nothing worthwhile that they live for. No goals. Like, just no drive. It just, I look at it and it's just, just, it's, it's sad. It's horrible. And that's why you shouldn't be that way. Now, you shouldn't hang out with people that are like that. And that is why you're like that. I only hang out with people if they benefit me. And I've done this since the very start, since I was young. That was like, I had very bad instincts when I was young that I trained away. One of the good instincts that I always had is I would always like pick, hang out with people who I could learn something from. Like it would go as far as, all right, this guy was the coolest kid in class. So I'll just like befriend him and hang out with him just because I want to know how to be the coolest guy in class too. I'll just be like, yo, this guy, he's such charisma. He's just fun to hang around with. I want to learn how to be like him. I remember. And I'll tell you guys these, these stories because I'm not fake like these fucking motherfuckers on YouTube and they be like, oh yeah, I was always perfect, you know, I was always this fucking amazing guy. The masculine truth is that you need to improve and improving means that you weren't as good before. You need to get better and better and better and better. That is the true masculine essence. No guy on this planet is born a fucking boss that is built. And even me back then, I literally asked this guy. Thought it was funny, but for me it wasn't funny because we were like in the group and then this other guy came and he was just like fucking being annoying. And then my friends would like diss him away. Like he would just diss him and it was like a diss fight. Like, yeah, do, do, do. Just diss him and then we, and then basically, my friends, they dissed him so hard that he just fucking went away. And I asked my friend, hey, bro, can you like help me? Like, how do you how do you do this? How do you diss people? He's like, oh, you know, you, you funny question. You want to know how to diss people? Yeah, I want to know that. I want to know that. Show me, show me, bro. I want to know everything because I'm going to fucking surpass everyone. And then you just build. Boom, 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 boom. But you can only do that if you hang out with people you can benefit from. Hang out with people who are richer than you. Hang out with people who are stronger than you. Hang out with people who are smarter than you. Hang out with people who have more charisma than you. And then you just take from everyone. Just take, take. At least you have people in my mind. Like I know from this guy, I learned charisma. From this guy, I learned how to get bitches. I do have to admit, I, I was born fucking in shape. But even like role models, I'll learn from Usain Bolt, Mayweather. Those people I didn't meet, but I'll learn from these people. And you just gotta hang out or 
okay, from this guy, I learned how to make money. Yeah, I want to make more money. I want to make a lot of money. I'm going to learn from these guys, from businessmen. Oh, shit. You know, I want to I want to learn, like, how to fuck... Like, this guy has, like, fucking five girlfriends. I want to know what that guy does. Teach me. I'll invite the guy to dinner. I'll be like, hey, bro, let's go to dinner. All paid for by me. And I just want to learn. I'll make the meeting about him. I'll make him feel like the fucking G. I'll make him feel amazing. Because in my mind, he is amazing. I want to learn from that guy. What you guys do, though, you just have, like, your little small, small friend groups. And, yeah, he's a friend. Why the fuck is he a friend? Like, yeah, my, my, little, my little friend group. And then we'll go together and smoke weed and hang out and beat the fucking club the the it's just pathetic to be honest it's just absolutely pathetic i dare you i tell you to do this look at everyone around you like everyone you hang out hang out with everybody and ask yourself who can i get something from literally ask yourself the question who can i get something from and then literally right on the paper okay from this guy i can get this from this guy i can get this but now the flip side is how do you get it the way you get it is by giving how can you give make him feel important make him feel special be a good guy to hang around with just be that guy who doesn't fucking have a big ego just just be like, oh shit, G, that's fucking amazing. Oh, cool. Oh shit, how did you do this? Did it? And then th these guys, they'll feel amazing. If this happens with me as well, like guys, I'll hang out with guys and I'll be like, yo, this guy doesn't give a shit. I don't know. This is fucking brokey. Like he's in shape. He's a brokey. He's just a nobody. I'm just admitting it. It's just nobody. But then I'll be like, yo, I'm still hanging out with this guy. And the reason I'm hanging out with him is just because he's just, I don't know, he's just like, he makes me feel interesting. He'll just be like, hey, fucking wow, oh my god, why did you do this? How did you do this? He'll just ask me questions and I was just like, I want to i just want to teach like people have this instinct they want to teach look let me tell you one thing the worst thing you can do if you want to learn from someone who has value is to pretend like you also got it so let me give an example i would hang out with this guy and i would ask him like hey how's the, how's the situation with you and chicks and be like yeah you know spang one new chick every week you know but you know, i don't keep them you know they're not good enough for me that and for some reason i could just look through it like i just knew this guy was capping and i would ask him like questions you know I would ask him like, hey, how would you like handle this in a relationship? And I would just give him some scenario where a bitch is like, yeah, I'm going to break up. Da -da. How, how would you handle it? And then he would just tell me stuff. And I just knew he, he didn't have it. And I was like, bro, how are you acting like this? Everyone here knows that you don't got shit. You, you ain't got the skills, bro. Why are you acting like you got the skills? Lishi, you would be better off just sitting and just shutting the fuck up and just listening. Just listening to true game. But instead, you choose to act like the big shot. But you're not the big shot. And now, I don't want to hang out with you anymore because you are a fraud but if it was just like oh shit yeah how do you do it prince or or my other friends or the people hang out shit how you do it oh that's amazing oh how do you guys make money oh wow you do this oh that's fucking crazy oh shit and then you were able to fucking moose this and then you fucking like you got money this way oh shit and then you made 5k a, a day doing this oh my god that's amazing and i feel like i want to fucking spit i want to i want to get value you know you, you understand how it works so don't make that mistake guys just shut the fuck up look at your friend friend select which one's actually good which one you can actually learn something from who's ambitious who's actually like trying to get it in life who actually has something that you don't you know stay in contact with them throw everyone fucking away stop talking to them listen just throw them away stop talking to them like bam, throw away like in the trash stop talking to them look at who you can contact ig social media groups youtube so you can learn something from them or guys that you know in your vicinity give them as much as you can if you can't invite them to dinner pay for the club that time if it's really like a guy you want you, you like right you want to learn from him. he'll want to hang out with you after that he'll have respect for you just be this cool guy you know be like yeah you look up to him he'll teach you game and that's how you fucking learn and fucking keep leveling up